It is the last day of fall. Tomorrow will be the first day of winter, and I'm going to harvest what's left of this green lettuce. Over the course of the last week, this lettuce started looking bad. It started drooping over, and I better harvest it while it's still looking good. Just like this red lettuce that still looks great. I'm gonna leave that alone, and instead just take out the lettuce that is left in these two pots. Notice the red lettuce that was mixed in with this pot still looks pretty good, it grew back. But either way, I think it's time just to cut out what is left and then be done with these two pots of lettuce. So here's the big green pot and it looked great last week. Now, not so much. A lot of this lettuce is looking fine and is perfectly good to eat, but unfortunately, a bunch of it is going to be wasted because it's now wilted and doesn't look good anymore. Look at all that's left over. So that's what happens. Timing is important when you're harvesting. If you get it too late, it will go bad. Pick it while it's ripe. The kale still looks really good. I got a lot of kale last week. In fact, so much that I haven't finished eating it yet. So instead, I'll be harvesting some of these broccoli leaves. And this broccoli never actually formed broccoli flowers like you're used to eating, but these leaves are edible. So what I'm gonna do is go around each of these broccoli plants and cut the bottom leaves off. And cutting off the bottom leaves will make the plant grow new leaves up at the top, at least hopefully. It is winter and this is not getting that much sun. Also, I'm gonna get some of this cauliflower. Cauliflower is a cousin of the broccoli. It looks very similar. And I'm going to do the same thing. Cut off some of the leaves that are at the bottom. and Hopefully it will stimulate more growth toward the top of the plant. This last harvest of the fall are lots of leaves. Here are some lettuce leaves and we have broccoli leaves and cauliflower leaves.